The Color Purple by Alice Walker is a powerful and emotionally charged novel that explores the life of Celie, an African-American woman in the early 20th century South. The narrative is presented in the form of letters, spanning over several decades, as Celie writes to God to make sense of her tumultuous and often painful experiences. The novel unfolds against the backdrop of racism, sexism, and the oppressive conditions faced by African American women during this period. The story begins with Celie as a 14 year old girl, pregnant with her father's child, who is taken away shortly after birth. The oppressive and abusive nature of Celie's life is immediately apparent, as she endures physical and emotional abuse from her father. Her letters reveal a deep sense of isolation and powerlessness as she struggles to find her voice in a world that has stripped her of agency. Celie's life takes a drastic turn when she is married off to Albert, a man she refers to as Mr. The marriage is one of convenience for Albert, and Celie becomes a virtual servant in his household. The relationship is marked by violence and cruelty, with Celie enduring years of mistreatment. Throughout this period, Celie continues to write letters to God, seeking solace and understanding. The narrative takes a significant shift with the introduction of Shug Avery, a blues singer and Albert's former lover. Shug becomes a central figure in Celie's life, offering her not only companionship but also a source of strength and empowerment. Shug's arrival marks a turning point for Celie, as she begins to assert herself and question the societal norms that have confined her. The bond between Celie and Shug evolves into a deep and complex relationship that goes beyond the conventional boundaries of friendship. Shug encourages Celie to explore her own desires and to reject the oppressive forces that have governed her life. The novel portrays their connection as a source of liberation for Celie, allowing her to reclaim her identity and challenge the oppressive systems that have kept her subdued. The Color Purple also explores themes of sisterhood through the characters of Nettie and Sophia. Nettie, Celie's younger sister, faces her own challenges as she becomes a missionary in Africa. Her letters, initially withheld by Albert, eventually reach Celie, providing a lifeline and a connection to family. Sophia, a strong-willed woman who defies societal expectations, becomes a source of inspiration for Celie as she witnesses Sophia's resistance against the injustices she faces. Walker's novel delves into the complex dynamics of race, gender, and sexuality. It addresses the intersectionality of oppression faced by African American women during this period, highlighting the ways in which systemic racism and sexism work in tandem to limit their autonomy. The novel doesn't shy away from depicting the harsh realities of domestic violence, sexual abuse, and the dehumanizing effects of racial discrimination. As Celie undergoes a transformative journey, the novel also explores the theme of self discovery and empowerment. Celie learns to assert herself, cultivate her talents, and challenge the societal norms that have confined her. Through her letters, readers witness Celie's growth from a voiceless and oppressed individual to a woman who finds her strength and voice. The narrative structure, presented through Celie's letters, adds a layer of intimacy and authenticity to the storytelling. Readers are given a direct window into Celie's thoughts and emotions, creating a powerful connection with the protagonist. The use of dialect and colloquial language further immerses readers in the cultural and historical context of the characters. One of the striking aspects of The Color Purple is its exploration of spirituality and the ways in which individuals find strength and resilience in the face of adversity. Celie's letters to God serve as a form of prayer, a means of processing her experiences, and a way to maintain a connection to something beyond her immediate circumstances. The novel doesn't adhere to a traditional religious framework but instead explores spirituality as a personal and transformative force. The Color Purple received both acclaim and criticism upon its release, with praise for its honest portrayal of the African American experience and criticism for its explicit content and challenging themes. The novel won the Pulitzer Prize for Fiction and the National Book Award for Fiction in 1983. Its adaptation into a film and a Broadway musical further solidified its impact and reach. In conclusion, The Color Purple by Alice Walker is a profound and impactful novel that explores the complexities of the human experience, particularly for African-American women in the early 20th century South. 
Through the lens of Seeley's letters, the novel addresses themes of oppression, resilience, sisterhood and self-discovery. Walker's storytelling is raw, intimate and unapologetic, providing readers with a glimpse into a world marked by injustice and the enduring strength of the human spirit. The Color Purple stands as a timeless work that continues to resonate with readers, challenging them to confront uncomfortable truths and celebrate the triumph of the human spirit over adversity. If you enjoyed this summary and support this channel, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more literary adventures, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Tell me which character's story touched your heart or share your favorite moment from the book. Thank you until our next chapter together. Bye. Take care, and love you.